So the instrument that you can see here is used by your dentist and is called a periodontal probe, also known as a dental probe. This probe is used in the space between your teeth and gums called the gingival sulcus in order to check the probing depth. The normal probing depth is usually 2 to 3 mm. Anything beyond that is considered inflammation of the gum. In this patient, this gum inflammation is evident by the appearance of blood while probing, which usually shouldn't be there if there is a normal probing depth. Meanwhile, we can appreciate the proper use of dental floss in order to get rid of this inflammation. The proper way of using a dental floss is to slip it in between your teeth, slide it around the gum line and then drag it into the gingival sulcus on either sides. This is a very efficient way of using a dental floss and it can help you remove the accumulated plaque in between your teeth and into the gingival sulcus, hence preventing gum inflammation. Remember that good oral hygiene practices like this can help prevent gum disease and maintain a healthy smile. Thank you for watching.